What's up, YouTube? It's your boy Pick Plug back again with another video. And today, we'll be happy to Friday's picks for today. We got some WNBA plays, and we're definitely looking to cash out because the last WNBA video we did actually sweep every single pick and we cashed out big, big time. So, if you guys are able to cash out from that last WNBA video, make sure to comment down below that you did cash out. We do love these WNBA videos. If you guys are liking them too, make sure to comment down below WNBA with your cash app if you guys do want a chance to win $50. And also comment down below your favorite pick of the day if you guys do want that chance to win $50. And if you guys do want a another five pick parlay in the next video, make sure to smash that like button. Let's get this video to 140 likes and I will get you guys that five pick parlay. I do want to quickly share with you guys this NFL play that cashed me out today. I got $75 just on the low end and this was just from the outlet sports betting AI. It was able to cash me out big time and this is just one play out of the six slips that I place per day. So if you guys are interested in getting access to this outlet, AI is super highly profitable, over 70% win rate, and it really has been killing it recently. Make sure to click that link in the description below. Go ahead and check out the outlet AI, and you will also have access to the full Discord where you will be able to have access to all of the analyst picks and get daily picks every single day, high profitable plays with explanation, and cash out big time. Here's some plays that have cashed out this week. For those of you that are wondering if we're only doing prize picks, there are multiple sports books that we bet on. We cash out on every single playbook, ranging from prize picks to FanDuel. So if you guys are interested, wherever you bet, you will be able to find a sports book for you and a analyst for you to be able to cash out on. Charlie, who is one of our top tier analysts, is on a 11 slip streak. He has been cashing out for the past couple of days, and he is not stopping anytime soon. So if you guys are looking to hop on that streak while he's hot, make sure to click that link in the description below and cash out with us. Now, a lot of these plays are high value, and they do change very, very often. A lot of these plays get bumped every second of the day. So you guys definitely want to stay on your toes and definitely be subscribed and turn your post notifications if you guys do want access to these high profitable plays. So make sure to smash that subscribe button and turn your post notifications. But without further ado, let's hop into today's picks. For our first play, we'll be going over to the WNBA first half. And I'm really liking this line for Kaylin Clark on the 11 first half points. This one is going to be going on the under. The last couple of games, she's been inconsistent. And definitely against this team, this matchup is not looking too good for her at all. Looking up against this team, she's gone on the under for the last game that she did play. And I do believe that the history will repeat on this game. Looking here on Outlier, which is the best optimizing tool that you guys can use to have historical data, I suggest that you guys click that link in the description below and get access to the 7-day free trial and cash out on this tool. We can see that she's hit this line in only 4 out of the last 10 games, which is 40%. She's averaging 10.8 with a median of 9.5, and she's missed this line in 6 uh, games. She's only hit this line in 9 out of the last 20 games, and she is 0% head-to-head, and she's played this team three times this year so i definitely do see that her she's struggling this against this team specifically because they are sixth in points allowed and they're seventh against the guard position overall they're pretty solid defensively middle of the pack but she just seemed uh that she can't get over on this on this specific matchup so it's going to be a little bit tough for her an alternative for this prop though that i'm really liking as well is the first half points plus rebounds it is more of the same reasoning but the reason why i'm really liking this prop is because going up against the assists we can see that they are third in assists and they are really locking down that defensive position on the assist also the um first for the regular points tab on prize picks you guys can find this line at 21.5 i do believe that this is a lot higher than it should be um, i do believe that in the last couple of games she's been playing really well but against this team the matchup isn't looking too good for her as well so you guys have three alternatives for you guys to pick um, I do really like the first half points, but on the under for most of these lines is a good decision for this game. If you guys are liking this prop, let me know down in the comment section below. For our next prop, we'll be going to the points section, and we'll be scrolling down to the Courtney Williams prop for 12.5 points. I'm really like this line to go on the over. Now, we can see that she's averaging 13.8 in the last five games, and she's missed this line in her last two. But I do have solid reasoning to go on the over for this prop, considering that, if, as we can see here in the list, she's gone up against Chicago and been able to go on the over for this points tab, having 22 points. 
pretty easily. And we can see in the last 10 games that she is 60%, averaging 14.4 in the last 10 games, which is pretty solid. Overall, she's going up to a team that is 7th in points allowed. They are pretty solid defensively. They're middle of the pack, but she is proven to go on the over for this prop in a tight game, having 22 points, which I'm really liking. We can't see head-to-head. -head. She's hit this line 50% of the time. But in close games, which I do believe this will be another close game, she will be able to go on the over for this prop. And she did average the exact same amount of minutes, um, which is definitely not a problem. She does have a solid amount of minutes per game, averaging 26.1 minutes. So she will get enough minutes to go on the over for this prop. She's been skimming this line a little bit, having 12 in the last two games. But it's about time that she goes on the over for this line. She did end up having a... Um, Pretty solid margin in the last game. It was pretty wide, so she didn't wasn't able to go on the over for that line. But this game, I do have a solid confidence that this line, game will be pretty close enough for her to go on the over for this line. Now, I know my last prop was against um, Kaylin Clark going on the over for the points, and I did say that she will go on the under for a lot of props. But if you guys are liking this line on the Courtney Williams, you will be able to get a free prop on Sleeper to go on the over for 0.5 points on sleeper for Caitlin Clark and if you throw this line in with K Caitlin Clark it will be an absolute steal and you're definitely making a bunch of money so I suggest that you guys click that link in the description below use code trophy get up to $500 in your first deposit match as well as you will be able to win up to 100 times on your payout boost which is way over the limit on prize picks so if you guys are interested in checking out sleeper make sure to click that link in the description below use the promo code um, trophy and you'll be able to cash out on the free prop for Caitlin Clark 0.5 points for our final prop again if you guys do want a five pick parlay in the next video smash that like button let's get this video to 140 likes for that five pick parlay we have been cashing out like crazy recently if you guys do want additional picks make sure to hit that like button we can go over to the rebounds tab scrolling down I really do like this Jackie Young play for the four rebounds on the under she's missed this line in the last three games averaging 3.2 in her last five and she's just played this team indiana for their, um she's gone the under having three rebounds and i'm again i'm really like this line to go on the under just because of how she has been playing recently she's been really struggling and we can see that on outlier we can see that in the last couple of games she's been 40 percent in the last 10 and head to head she is zero percent against this team tying most of the time at four, but I will say that most sports books, as we can see on DG Fantasy, that most sports books, actually a couple of sports books do have it at 4.5. Now this is not completely uploaded, but I do see on Underdog that right now they do have 4.5 on Underdog, and DG Fantasy is telling me to go on the under for Prize Picks, which is a pretty solid percentage, and they do have access to a bunch of these solid percentage, a whole list of these great props to go on the under or over four they are great percentage props and they've been helping me to go on and cash out props and be able to profit from a lot of these plays just from looking at this list having to do little to no research i've been able to cash out like crazy so if you guys are interested in dg fantasy make sure to click that link in the description below use code trophy and get 25 percent off of dgfantasy.com that will be all for today's video. If you guys did enjoy these picks, but you do want even more exclusive plays, make sure to click that link in the description below. You will be able to cash out from the Outlet Discord, and you'll have daily picks every single day to be able to choose from. Again, we have been streaking, so make sure to hop on the streak as soon as possible so you guys can cash out as well. Thank you guys for watching. Make sure to leave a comment down below your favorite pick of the day, and like and subscribe. I will catch you guys in the next one. Peace.